What's up? Space Monkey here, and welcome back to another Weapons of Call of Duty. And today we're on Call of Duty Black Ops 4, and we're going to talk about another operator mod called the Dragon Breath Operator Mod. Now, this operator mod is for the Mog 12 shotgun, which is a secondary weapon in Call of Duty Black Ops 4. And once you uh, max it out, you're able to actually uh, get the uh, secondary operator mod card there and uh, you're able to actually put the dragon breath on this weapon and as you can see there um, your damage is up now that's one thing that I do like about uh, this operator mod in particular um, and the other thing that I like about this operator mod is it reminds me of incinerary shells uh, now you didn't see it on the first guy that I just killed there, but on the second guy I got a hit marker on him first to see his body still on fire. That is what the Dragon Breath Operator mod does for the Mog 12. It basically turns all of your uh, shots into, uh, you know, like uh, incinerary rounds or like uh, fire and buckshot combined together. You know, like fire rounds. I mean, it's it's definitely fun to do. You just run around and you know shotgun people and watch them catch on fire and uh, melt right in front of you. The other thing that's fun to do is to get those nice juicy bloodthirsties uh, with this operator mod. Also, those of you that have watched any of my uh, operator mods for Black Ops 4 videos, the bloodthirsties are my thing, and that is what I am doing getting bloodthirsties with the operator mods on these weapons and it's definitely fun to do uh, you know I get a great experience going on um, you know yeah I die just like everybody else does and that's what the uh, respawn button is for um, so just to let you guys know you know I'm not a perfect Call of Duty player but I do dig a really nasty bloodthirsty and when it comes to playing with the Dragon Breath Operator mod for the Mog 12, it's it's just a lot of fun to run around and uh, mow those people down with flames. So once again, I hope you guys enjoyed today's gameplay. Don't forget to smash that like button. Your support is definitely needed and appreciated. And don't forget to subscribe. That way, you'll be able to keep up with all the content in the videos and the bloodthirsty videos that I put out there uh, just like this one. This one I tried to, uh, instead of editing a lot of editing and you know all that, I just decided just to show the gameplay as it is. Um, you know I really wasn't feeling it on this map. I don't understand. I don't know if it was just I had something on my mind or what. but. In the end, I was still able to get that nice, juicy, bloodthirsty, and that, to me, uh, is always rewarding. Uh, it's all—it's also a, a mood changer. I mean, if you're in like a bad mood and you jump on a Call of Duty game and you want to take out some frustration and uh, you know, basically just take out your aggression on everybody you possibly can and who you see you can just jump on a free-for-all match or a domination match or, or like on here uh, they have the uh, domination mosh pit thing I don't know exactly what it's called but it made it where the score is higher than normally and uh, that gives you plenty of time to run around and uh, set your traps you know depending on who you are and right now I, I am playing as Torque um, you know and get a feel for the map you know try to get your little bearings together and come up with a game plan to take down the bad guys and for me it's always fun to do um, you know it's enjoyable it's a game changer sometimes um, and sometimes you just get that nice wonderful run you play crappy the whole game and then you get this one run that is flawless, absolutely flawless, beautifully done, and well, uh, you know, com well done, you know, what I'm saying, and y that's really rewarding for me. That makes my uh, game rage upset. Come on, you know, turn into a uh, heck yeah, I'm melting, you know, kind of thing. So, once again, I hope you guys enjoy the gameplay. Uh, thanks for watching. 
Today's operator mod is the Dragon Breath for the Mog 12. Um, Bloodthirsties, it should be really not an issue when it comes to playing with this weapon. Uh, you know, you get yourself in a nice, good little lobby, get a feel for the map, get a feel for the weapon, and then just start knocking them out. So, anyway, I'm going to leave you guys with the rest of the clip. Thanks for watching. This is Space Monkey, and until next time, peace. Ruin. Threat down. Losing Charlie. Enemy cluster grenade. Securing Bravo. Sentry up and running. Tango down. Deploy UAV on my grid. Losing A. Shoot him. Losing Charlie. <laughs> 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 <laughs>